Hilary Franu, and I recently went on a course with Senior Pass, which was funded by the European Union and run by Community Action Decorum in Hemel Hempstead. What I've got here is my story of how I started before Senior Pass and what happened on my journey all the way to the end here where we arrived in Gourbine, where we were going to talk about everybody, the seven places across Europe who had run the course and the benefit it had had for all the people who'd taken part in it. So, the reason it's pictorial is because a lot of people who were coming along, their first language wasn't English, so we wanted it as universal as possible. So, here we start. Not a very happy person, that's me. And I have been out of work for nearly two years, and I'm feeling very sorry for myself, and I feel like I've tried all the options out there to get a job, and I'm becoming really despondent. But... When I'm doing a voluntary job, a very nice lady from Community Action Decorum comes in. This was my first introduction to Senior Pass. I didn't really know what was involved from the term. I filled in the application form because it was free. I still didn't really have much idea what was going on. So I turned up at CAD at the appointed time and I found out what we were going to learn was skills and changes of attitude that would help us be more employable. The biggest thing we were going to do was create an e-portfolio. That is a way of putting together all your paper skills, your visual skills, your video skills, illustrations. It can all go into one place on the web. So, this all sounds a bit daunting to be done in um, 12 hours, but once we'd all got to know each other, we found we were all from different walks of life, but our story was pretty much the same. And we found that once we started doing some of the project work, we all had real world skills that were valuable today, of use to current employers. We found out that we ourselves were of value to our community, to our workplace, to our families. We should really feel proud of all the things we've managed to do in our 50 years. We were being supported. We were being given more ideas of what we could do to keep up with our goals that we were aiming for. And I thought, that's been wonderful. I'm feeling very positive. I can move forward. But I thought that's the end. Oh no. A few weeks later, CAD get in touch with me and say, we're running the course again. Would you like to appear on Radio Decorum and be interviewed to tell other people how you've benefited from the course? And I thought, I'm brilliant. Yes, of course I will. I want other people to benefit the same way that I did. So, I appear on the radio. More people come along to the course because they've heard about it and they're not scared because they've heard someone saying what it's going to be like. My skills start working. I start getting asked for interview. I get offered a job. It isn't full time, but the place I was volunteering for says, we can top up the money and you can now get paid for what you were doing as voluntary work before. All my dreams for that year have come true. So I'm thinking, this has got to be the end. And no, come November, I'm contacted again by the lovely CAD. They say the project funding is coming to an end. They're going to do a review session and would I like to travel to Latvia as one of the students who benefited, who can then explain to all the other groups what it was that we did and how we interpreted the senior pass in Hell Hempstead. So, 15 years I haven't been abroad, suddenly I've got to get a passport. I've got to um, think, I don't speak Latvian. At Vainoja es nerunayo latviski. C-A-D with two weeks to go, plan for me to have Latvian lessons. So I've got my passport, I've got all my expenses paid, I've gone to Latvia, I'm abroad for the first time in 15 years. I'm surrounded by people who have had this same effect that I've had. And the thing is, it's not just us who's benefiting it, it's everybody who comes into contact with us who is feeling 
the benefit of us wanting to support other people, us feeling confident. So now I have to say to myself, I don't want this to be the end. I want other people to benefit. I want you to see this video, see what it's done for me, and refund the project so that more people can integrate with society. Thank you. I think the best way to sum up how I've benefited from the Senior Pass course is I call it the Barocca effect. It's as if the course has given me permission to go out and be myself but on a good day. It has increased my confidence, it refreshed my skills, and it gave me a new impetus to go out and achieve my life goals. Some of the things I enjoyed for the course were having an opportunity to go behind a video camera and film an elevator pitch, which is in effect a way of putting your CV on video. I enjoyed meeting the other people on the course and finding out that we all have very similar stories and were able to support each other during the course. And also that I went away with a brand new skill, which is how to create an e-portfolio online. Well, it's given me the confidence to shine in job interviews. It's given me the ability to time manage and set goals that are achievable. And I can assess my progress as I go along, which has all led to me getting my ultimate goal, which is paid employment. What I particularly liked is that our story was reflected with all the other organisations who'd taken up to do the senior pass. Not everybody had interpreted it in the same way. Some people did courses for job skills, other people took uh, their people abroad and they did volunteering um, opportunities which meant um, everybody developed, they got a community spirit and they were able to take whatever skills and confidence they had and go and share it with the community. It just multiplied the good. Attending the final meetings really clarified for me how much I have progressed in the last year and that my life is practically unrecognisable in terms of my confidence, where I am, what I feel capable of doing and again seeing that reflected across all the nations, across the people who have done this course and that we were able to come together as a group consolidate what we've learnt and hopefully put it forward as an initiative that means it will get refunded. That's my goal for the end. I want it to be refunded.